What's up, y'all? Hey, man. Coming at y'all with another Goddess of Victory Nikkei video, man. Hey, man. Now, uh, today it looks like we got the uh, the patch notes for the 1.5 anniversary. It should be pretty much a recap of what we already seen during the live stream, but I know you guys kind of like this stuff, so I'm gonna just go over it as quickly as possible. Hey, make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe. Make sure you like the video because I don't really be on that reading stuff. I don't, I, me personally, I don't really like reading a lot, but hey, I'm here for y'all. So just in case y'all miss anything, uh, I'm gonna be going over everything right here, right now. So let's hop into it. So basically, commanders, the server will be offline uh, for maintenance on the 25th. So the update is actually gonna be on the 25th, if you didn't already know that. So expect maintenance to be on the 25th, and then it's obviously gonna reopen after maintenance is complete. And usually get like usually get like some maintenance gems or something like that. Usually like 300 maintenance gems. So normal stuff typical stuff there is something right here so it says uh bay will be available in the ordinary recruit social recruit and from the mold so yeah if you were somebody like me who are really interested and really liked uh bay's design uh or her kid or you just liked her in general and you were just holding out on her you can go ahead make sure you update your uh, ordinary recruit wish list. Make sure you update your wish list if you want it, Bay, and go ahead and put her on there. So, on the 25th, she should be available. All right. So the major updates. Obviously, we have Crown. She's going to be the new pilgrim. Uh, it says Crown assists the squad in both offense and defense, supporting Nikkei's in their attacks when using their bur their burst skills. She can provide additional effects when restored. Um, we kind of seen her skills in the live stream, um, but they didn't have the numbers. They should be coming out here soon with the actual percentages and numbers of what she actually does. I think they kind of learned from the whole Red Hood uh, drama from last year. So they were holding out till now. So we should see here soon. They just released uh, Kilos. So we should be getting crowns numbers uh here soon so yeah she's a defender uh her weapon is a uh, your majesty machine gun iron code and obviously she's a pilgrim it's going to be available on the 25th that's when the event actually starts um same normal stuff hey if you have golden tickets use your golden tickets because it's a one percent rate up and you know anything about that they're pretty brutal so i hope be, hopefully you've been uh, acquiring pity this whole time uh kilo is also going to be available uh kilo is going to be free though so just keep that in mind kilo is going to be free so ssr nikkei kilo who fights alongside the humanoid weapon talos joined the battlefield kilo's combat style varies depending on whether the shield is maintained she unleashes a full attack that becomes more powerful the higher her HP when the shield is maintained and sets a more powerful shield when the shield is destroyed. So it looks like she has a shield that basically keeps on refreshing and stacking up over time depending on the battle. Seems pretty good. Really, 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 really thick shields. You know what I'm saying? Class is a defender. Dang, we getting a lot of defenders, bro. I mean, hey, we need more defenders. We got a bunch of attackers, not a lot of defenders. And machine gun too. Hey, that's definitely that's definitely a rare sight for machine guns. Uh, fire code missileless. Uh, so here's what you're talking about about uh, kilo being obtained for free. So it says kilo can be obtained in the story event Last Kingdom, 14 day login, and the 1.5 year anniversary event. You may check the new events information below to find out how. Kilo will not be available in the special recruit, ordinary recruit, new commander, special recruit, ordinary recruit, social recruit, or and from mold. So you cannot get Kilo via these methods. You have to get her through either the story event, Last Kingdom, 14 day login, and 1.5 anniversary event. That's how you're gonna get like the copies and everything like that. And this is gonna be free, obviously. So just keep that in mind. You don't have to summon for anything like that. You just get it for free just by doing the events and stuff and logging in. 
uh, temporary participation Nikkei uh, crown so crown obviously so you know about the whole um, if you don't already know if you're new or whatever like that Nikkei has like a firing range essentially so you can go to the firing range and try the latest Nikkei coming out uh, it's like a practice like kind of see fill them out see if you like them or not uh, see how they perform on the battlefield um, so crown is going to be obviously uh, available for testing in the fire range on the 25th and it's going to go through May 16th I guess this is the duration so you have a long time to test and test her out in the fire range and see if you like her more than likely most everybody's going to get her because she's a pilgrim just off of that alone so yeah uh, we have new costumes as you guys seen in the live stream. We have the Modernia Second Affection, which looks really amazing. Uh, I know a lot of people are not actually happy because of this right here. So just know that, yes, we do have a new Modernia uh, costume, but it is unfortunately a costume gotcha. I'm not going to go too much into that because I already know how players feel about it, but just so you're aware, it is indeed a costume gotcha it is not a variant for the modernia uh, special costumes for snow white so snow white also got a, a, a new skin so hers is going to be snow white white knight can be obtained in the 1.5 anniversary pass so there's going to be a pass for her you know you guys know how they do that so as you can see down here they have diesel's costume as well the uh, uh, midnight strawberry so you know how they have sometimes they have the mission pass and then they have like the event pass so same thing here snow white is going to be in the anniversary pass and then uh, diesel is going to be available in the mission pass you know this stuff we've seen before you got to basically buy the pass they're like what i believe they're like twenty dollars or so for like the mission pass i forget how much the anniversary pass is i forgot if it was twenty dollars or not but i know the mission pass is usually twenty dollars so uh, special costume for crown now that is actually interesting this is actually interesting they did mention this in the live stream but they didn't I don't remember them showing her costume and if I'm not mistaken if I if I missed it let me know down in the comment section but I don't think we've seen a new costume for her so it's a special costume crown costume crown costume will crown costume with full voiceover burst animation standing pose and special sd actions will be coming soon please stay tuned boy i ain't gonna lie i hope it has some yeah you know what i'm saying i hope it has some jps shout out to tamias you know what i'm saying hey please shift up you got one job please you know what i'm saying because crown's already you know she 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 got a little bit of JPS, you know. The shooting pose is is is, is decent. I ain't gonna lie. I ain't gonna oversell it or anything like that. It's decent, but it could be a lot better, to be honest. Let's be real now. And I'm hoping this costume delivers just that. Please deliver the yacht in the JPS. You know what I'm saying? So that is definitely something to look out for right here. Crown's costume. I'm I'm definitely looking forward to seeing that. Please don't mess this up, shift up. You have one job. Hook her up with the Makima special. And that better. Like just you you know what to do. Uh new events. Obviously, the last kingdom is the new story event. It's gonna be available on the 25th. And then go all the way to May 16th. Uh it's basically talking about the story and everything like that. So pretty self-explanatory story event part one and part two you know how it goes part three uh, is a challenge mode uh, pretty pretty standard stuff here you know how they go they do story mode then there's a hard mode then there's a challenge mode uh, looks like it's going to have a coordinated operation who's the boss uh, from 18 am I blind is it saying who the boss is defeat the boss and get broken cores and to exchange gems. Wait, who is the boss? Four man five. And it's not saying the boss unless I'm blind here. Archives, brand new year. Uh, that was a pretty decent event. So brand new year event's gonna be available. Mini game for the king. Now, actually, a lot of people were actually really looking forward to this. We like the mini games, such as Memory of Goddess, is one of the all-time favorite game mini games in Nikkei. Um, 
So this is a new one. I heard it's apparent supposedly like a tower defense or something like that. So that's going to be interesting. Hopefully it's as good as Memory of God is, but that's also going to be available. Something to look out look forward to on the 25th. Uh, 1.5 year anniversary. Again, the duration is from the 25th of April to the 16th. 14 day login. You know the deal with that. Just log in. This is actually important. Log in on any 14 days during the event and get rewards. Get a 1.5 year anniversary Nikkei selection box, Kilo or Ray. Advanced recruit vouchers and development materials when you log in for 14 days straight. Now this part right here is really important. So when you log in, you can get a selection box that either has Kilo or Ray. Uh, this was mentioned in the live stream. I also had a video on this. Um, so basically, you're gonna get Kilo. You should, if I'm not mistaken, you should get Kilo right when you um, like log in. Once you get in, everything like that, you should get her pretty quickly or do the event, something like that. You'll you'll get her real quick. But to get copies of her, you're gonna also get a Nikkei selection box by logging into the log, just simply by logging in. Um, so you can select Kilo or Ray. Me personally, I don't really mess with Ray like that. I don't I don't like Ray. I'm gonna be honest. But Kilo. Um, you can choose one or other. That's how you're going to get your dupes and get them to MLB and stuff of that nature. So just keep that in mind. Make sure you're logging in for the 14 day login. Uh, weekend only full birthday event. This is going to be live from April 27th to April 29th. And then it looks like from May 4th to May 6th. And then from May 11th to May 13th. So these are the the days that the full burst day is going to be available so keep that in mind if you know you want your extra materials on that daily bonus rewards uh looks like the same time frame so yeah you're going to get daily bonus rewards as well for the same duration 27th to the 29th 4th through the 6th of may and may 11th through may 13th so keep that in mind we're going to get a skill level reset so that's definitely good if you want to you know, change the skill levels for your Nikkei. Solo Raid is going to be available on May 2nd. Uh, get some Harmony Cubes. Who is the boss? Solo Raid, Solo Raid. Am I blind? Where's the boss? They don't, they're not showing the boss. I don't see the boss yet. Will the boss be um, Indivilia? I wonder if the boss is going to be Indivilia. I mean, that would make sense, right? Raid duration from the 2nd of... 2nd of May to the 9th. Uh, outpost theme event. They're going to change the outpost with decorations appropriate for the 1.5 anniversary, including like festival ornaments and firecrackers. New gameplays. New chapters are added. They're going to be adding chapter 29 and 30. This is all mentioned in the 1.5 uh, live, live stream anniversary. New Lost Sectors, so that's definitely good. New Lost Sectors 21 and EX07. New Floors in the Tribe Tower. Increase the number of floors in the Tribe Tower from 550 to 650. Increase the number of floors in Manufacturer Towers from 500 to 550. Uh, new Features, Profile Decorations. That's cool. So you get an uh, added the feature to decorate profile card with new backgrounds and stickers. Hmm, that's interesting. Hey, I'm always up for more personal customization. Please check the watch. Please check them out in the lobby profile. Profile decoration. Decoration items can be attained from the 1.5 year anniversary event, daily missions, and the content shop. Added a quick advise feature. Wow, that's actually pretty good. We, we we want this. This is actually pretty good. This will make things even quicker. That's convenient. Uh, new commodities. Uh-oh. 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 All right, here it is. Here's the juicy stuff. Hey, it's about to be a lot of folks mad in the comments, bro. You know how we feel about this. Like we said, costume gotcha for Modernia, second affection. We kind of already went over that up above. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So basically, this is saying about the uh, Modernia is basically a costume gotcha. But this right here. Uh oh. Uh oh. 
I, I can already hear people <laughs> banging on their keyboards mad as hell Jesus yikes there's gonna be some yikes free to play players about to be mad mad free to play players about to be heated bro costume gotcha crown costume yikes I hope y'all got a I hope they got a free free version for the free to play players otherwise they're gonna be they're gonna be big mad uh, costume gotcha crown costume rerun period from May 2nd to the 16th so her costume gotcha will be from the 2nd of May to the 16th y'all know how that goes RIP to free to play players my condolences let me a hey, let me know how mad y'all are in the comment section I know y'all feel some type of way I don't blame you. Hey, let it be out. Let it be known your concerns. Maybe Shift will see this video and, and hear how, you know, hear your concerns, hear your voice. Uh, 1.5 anniversary pass. Uh, this is, that's like with the, uh, with the Snow White. So we went over that Snow White stuff. Uh, mission pass is for Diesel. New character packages will be available. This is like with the cash shop and all that. I mean, I don't really go too much over there, but yeah, that is pretty much everything. This is the, like I said, the crown costume gotcha has kind of caught me off surprise. There's a few things that kind of caught me off surprise, like the crown costume, the quick advice is pretty interesting. Um, added new lost sectors, new tower floors. Uh, what else was pretty, pretty, you know, I'm interested in this mini game, so. There's quite a few things that they that are that I'm looking forward to seeing. So that is gonna wrap up this video. Let me know what y'all think down in the comment section about all the changes and updates coming to the game. And I will see you in the next video, man. Peace.